Law enforcement doesn't take a day off, and neither does criminal court. So every day of the year, criminal defendants go before a judge for first appearance hearings via closed-circuit TV from the county jail. And before that, they have all been interviewed and screened by county pretrial services. We interview everyone who comes into the jail within the last 24 hours. We do an independent investigation on everyone to see their community ties, their criminal history, and we go to court every morning, seven days a week, 365 days a year, to present that information to the judge so that they can make an independent review and set a reasonable bond or release. It's a process that allows judges to make quicker and more just decisions and helps to avoid jail overcrowding, all while striving to keep the community safe from potentially dangerous defendants. It's to keep the, the, those people that need to be kept in jail kept in jail and those people that can be safely monitored in the community, it allows us that opportunity. Having someone post a bond doesn't address the, the public safety issues, it just is a monetary bond saying that the defendant's going to come back to court, but it doesn't address a lot of the, the underlying factors as to what brought that particular defendant to this particular crisis in his or her life. We can assist in identifying individuals that are low risk. Um, and can be released and support their families, keep their jobs, stay, stay busy in the community as a productive citizen, as opposed to staying in jail because they couldn't come up with the bond money to get out. Which is exactly what happens all too often in counties without pretrial services. The judge goes in blind. They may or may not know that defendant because that defendant may or may not have been before them, but they don't have anything other than possibly the criminal history. We can give them more information. Um, we can give them clues as to why the behavior might have happened. We try not to deal with any of the facts of the case. We are just looking at safety of the community and re the likelihood of returning to court. And by doing those two things, we can keep our jail population at a minimum if possible um, because we're not housing a lot of people that don't need to be housed. Community supervision and case management services are provided free of charge to pretrial defendants to ensure court appearances and the defendant's compliance with release orders.